bringing you your best Del Marva Live. Here's a question for you. Are you looking to spice up some of your favorite foods or maybe add a little kick to your mm. upcoming Super Bowl party? Well, there is a business in Cambridge that can help you out with just that. That's right. And Del Marva Life's Brian Spires joins us from Krabby Grow. Brian, this store has stuff inside you won't find anywhere else. That's right, Lisa. You won't find it anywhere else at any other grocery store in the area, convenience store, retailers, anything. I mean, just take a look at some of the stuff on this shelf. Have you ever heard of West African voodoo juice? I doubt you have. I haven't until now. And let's just say there's plenty more where this came from. It may be cold outside, but it's heating up inside Krabby Gras in downtown Cambridge, and the source of the warmth is coming from these shelves. Pure flavor goodness. Keith Gravdius is the owner of Krabby Gras, which boasts hot sauces, rubs, and spices to give your food that extra flavor. You know, that's a great hot sauce to put on food, but you, if you have like cream cheese, you can pour it over your cream cheese, put it in the refrigerator, it's absolutely fantastic. Yeah. Take a good look at these labels and odds are you haven't seen or heard of them before. In fact, Graffy is handpicks what he sells in his store. We take very specific pride in our research and development team and the strides that we go to to bring spices and flavors to our customers that they can't get anywhere else. There's banana ketchup from the Caribbean island of St. Lucia, barbecue sauce with the taste of chocolate actually mixed in. Then there's coffee and bananas shipped directly from Cafe Du Monde in New Orleans. It's very popular too. I, I go through cases of that a month. It's ridiculous how, how, how popular it is. And the best seller of them all, slapping fat bacon ketchup. Yes, folks, you heard me right. Slapping fat bacon ketchup. And with the Super Bowl right around the corner, there's no better way to kick your favorite food up a notch. You can start in the mornings with one of our 15 different style Bloody Mary mixes for a little bit of Super Bowl pregame. We got some great spices, great wing sauces, great dips. But the flair inside Krabby Gras goes well beyond the bottles. I just thought it really fit what we were trying to say. Take a look at these shirts. All of them showcase the heritage of the Eastern Shore and have become popular among tourists and those who live in the area. This is just a really opportunity for, for people to show their culture and their pride of being Eastern Shore men and women. All right, and I am here with the owner of Krabby Gras, Keith Graffius. And Keith, uh, we want to talk about some of the other things that you have in the store real quick. Let's start us with the Bloody Mary mixes. That's right, Brian. We're getting into the playoffs. We got our Ravens games, and every good Super Bowl party or playoff party begins with a good pregame. So let's pregame it with a little Bloody Mary mix out here for demonstrations. We got some hog's breath from Key West. And we've got some starboard here from Dewey Beach. We got some great fixings to go along with it. And can we just make mention real quick of what you put this in right here, people? You got to see this. You a gotta... little bit of hillbilly stemware, baby. Hillbilly Get stemware. Going. That's what this is called. There's no alcohol in this, so don't worry about it. All right. Not in his. <laughs> That's good. That's spicy. All right. Moving on. Now, this real quick is your best seller. We just talked about it in the piece. Explain to us a little bit about it, and we're actually going to try some. When you go to the grocery store and you forget everything, when you shop at Krabby Grawl, it's all fine and dandy. Because you forget your ketchup, you forget your bacon. No need to worry, because you got slapping fat bacon ketchup in the refrigerator because you shop at Krabby Grawl. All right, let's slap that on there. That looks good right oh, about now. I can't believe I'm eating all this stuff. Absolutely amazing. All right. So, Jimmy and Lisa, we're going to send it back to you guys right now. I'm going to have some of this because, as you know, I love to eat food. Now, don't go anywhere That's because right. later on in the show, we're going to be back. We're actually going to be eating oyster ice cream. Yes, I said oyster ice cream, and you won't believe what we're going to be putting on it. So stick around, Jimmy and Lisa. We'll send it back to you guys. Uh, I'm wow. I'm still stuck on West African voodoo juice. Voodoo juice. I just couldn't get past that. Do you like things hot and spicy? I, I do. mean, hot and spicy. Mm -hmm. You no. do? No. No, you don't? no, no, no. I do, but not nearly as hardcore as my brother. Mm -hmm. Unless a sweat broke out on his forehead, he wasn't happy. <laughs> so we got to try some of this stuff. Oh Here's a question for you. Do you find a lot of month left at the end of your money? No, we have five ways to spend less and save more and how you could get personal financial advice for an entire year. 